Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. I'm your host, Logan23. You're joining me for Fallout Shelter on the PC Labor Day event. Labor dispute. Power to the people. Rescue Overseer Mogabi from Rhubarb's Raiders. A disgruntled dweller named Rhubarb has joined the Raiders and wants to liberate some local bolts with violence. Overseer Mogabi needs your help. Providing we don't get interrupted by death claws, fires, or anything else popping up before we jump to the mission. So we haven't done one of these in a very long time. Most of it's been other games. So I'm happy to finally come back to my Fallout uh, vault. Once in a while I'll log in, you know, send the dwellers out, do some missions, you know, dailies, things like that, but um, I'm really looking for content. I'm really looking for content. I'm also looking for Halloween in the vault, too. Please help! The raiders say they wanted to free us from the life of servitude. Then they open fire. The definition of freedom leaves something to be desired. Yes, an all new voice has just randomly appeared into my voice box. <laughs> oh. <clears throat> just sometimes I get the, you know, the inspiration. It's just, what's a voice that comes to the top of your head? Today is this voice. I don't know why, I've never done it before. But, hey. Well, I kind of did it for Eleanor, but Eleanor was more droopy and sad, like this. It was very sad, but this is more upbeat. Perhaps if we encounter anyone in the new Royal Romance Book 2, or the new uh, book choices is working on, perhaps this will be a new voice we will use. I will have to remember this. <laughs> That's actually pretty good. It's actually pretty smooth. Very easy. Um, I aim for voices like that. However, there are a lot of voices um, in choices series and whatnot that I, 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 some of their voices are, are very tough. You know, kind of like Jake's, you know? He's rough, he's gritty, he's aged, he's defined, and yet he's so badass. One man, one Jalupa stand. Um, I, I kind of have like a, Sean is... An interesting voice I like to do. Uh, William and James. The other day I was so tired when I did my recap, I got them confused. Um, <laughs> so I was calling James William and William James. Well, no, I don't think I called William James. I just kept going with William. Uh, I think it was because I was doing so much rules of engagement. Looky here, more dwellers need rescuing from their nightmare of endless labor. Rubar was right. The working conditions in these vaults is utterly deplorable. Don't worry. We'll end your eternal suffering. It's the least we can do. Psst. Please, rescuing? There's nothing but raiders raiding. And it ends here. You know, for a raider, your vocabulary is exemplary. Get a job, you bum! If I asked you to just chill out and not attack us, would you? No. And it ends here. It all ends all right for you! <gasps> dun, dun. Dun, dun, dun. Da, da, da. So, um, working on voices. Um, I kind of, if you've tuned in at all to the new Crown of the Flame for, um, not Leon, it was another guy. Oh, phew, close one. All in a day's work. Yay, Lunchbox. Um, if you've been tuning in to the Crown of the Flame Diamond Edition, I, so I've been doing, um, kind of like, um, little finger for, uh, I forget his name. It's, it's not gritty, like the old one like this, and these sound really old. It's, it's more like an age little finger, had he lived. I don't really want to spoil it for anyone who doesn't watch Game of Thrones or hasn't caught up to the season finale, but I digress. If I did spoil it... You've had weeks. I don't know what to tell you. Um, I'm like a little saddened by by that. I'm not gonna go into it, but a little saddened. A little saddened by a lot lately, if you think about it. There's so much uh, stuff going on. In, um... In not just America. Just all over the world. I feel like we have such an inconsistency right now. I'm not gonna do any drama. I just think we need to unite as a people, you know? Period. People, period. Humanity. <sighs> but I digress. If you talk about anything positive, YouTube hates you. Ugh. I don't 
don't get it. Talking about negative YouTube hate you. Talk about well that and the people hate you. You talk about positive. The people kind of like you, but then people also hate you, and then YouTube really hates you. I don't get it. Um, I don't know. When it comes to things like that, I'm gonna start going and and just doing my own thing. If it reaches a thousand views, it has to be manually reviewed, right? So we got a lunchbox, some theme recipes, some cola, a bunch of coins, which we really, really don't need. Oh, so we've got um. In case you haven't been watching some of my videos as of late, uh, we did Diamond Edition of Endless Summer. We're doing that. We started Crown the Flame. It was very not popular. Um, and then we did uh, Rules of Engagement Book 1 that's finally come to a close. It's complete, except for the Dean. I, I'm, I'll go back in time, do the Dean thing. Um, I have to reset it anyway to get to where I wanted to go in with William into Book 2, and then open all the diamond scenes, and then if something, you know, changes up or... You know, book three is the tough one. Book three is where it's you're stuck with whoever you officially pick. Yeah, you'll meet them and they'll be friends, and you know there's there's a lot of that. But um, <sighs> I got so much to work on, and right now I'm waiting for uh, I'm waiting for um, choices to come out with their their books for today. Today's Friday, or not Friday, Wednesday, by the way. So uh, this is one of the things I'm killing my time with. Um, besides doing work, I mean, technically this is work, but I'm waiting for, you know, choices to come on so I can jump right on that, so I can get to using the keys, you know, so I can jump right on, on doing work. And you know what, here, um, let's go ahead and make this a double. Not that one, that's a rare one. Here, we'll do a daily in this one, so I can keep talking to you folks if you want. Otherwise, feel free to tune out. <laughs> or, or, you know, if you got better things to do. So let's see here. Weapon run. That was a uh, daily. Yeah, require verse stash. It's going to be a short one. Yeah. Um, I, I kind of hope Bethesda puts in some more content for this game. I really love it. I mean, they did graphics revamp or anything. They put it on... Um, Xbox, I believe PS4. I don't play on console, especially a game like this. It's 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 nicer to use it with your finger on your phone, or in this case, a mouse. Um, it's like people were like, "Oh, you've been busy lately. You know, you've been playing Destiny 2." <laughs> Have you not checked my channel? Busy busting our content. My life is hectic. There is no. I mean, I could make some freeze time for Destiny 2, but one, it's it's. It's an FPS, which for those who don't know, first-person shooter. <clears throat> um, so, I prefer first-person shooters on PC. 99.9% .9 of FPSs I have played on it on computer if they come to computer. Otherwise, I mean, I guess you could look at... No, I wouldn't even say that's 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 FPS for, for Last of Us. Um... I mean that's more storytelling, but it was it was good. It the good mechanics for for the game overall. The multiplayer wasn't too bad. Um, I wasn't too overwhelmingly fond of it, but I did play quite a considerable amount of it for time killing purposes back then, and um, I enjoyed it. I look forward to Last of Us Two. Um, when that happens, I will definitely be streaming that. Last of Us Two. There's just a couple games. When it comes to Xbox, no. I'm trading that thing in. But when it comes to um, PS4, oh lordy. There's a couple games. There's a couple games. Kingdom Hearts, um, the new one, I want to I wanna do. Oh, I'm going to get addicted to that one. And I, 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 I have lost over time. I'm sure if I sat down and remembered some of it, I would remember what happened in Kingdom Hearts 1. For the most part, I remember I just don't remember specifics down to the, the, you know, the color of Jafar's dress. Um, but I will remember most of, you know, the storytelling aspects, um, when it comes to stuff like that. So I'm look I want to play that stuff, I want to get into it, 
Um, Detroit becomes more human. I'm looking to do that here this November. Um, providing YouTube stops and ceases their their um, shenanigans as of late, you know. Um, I'm looking. I, I want YouTube to start encouraging creators, you know, instead of discouraging me. Um, I'm a creator. I, I would like to stop being discouraged. That'd be greatly appreciated. I give you a hug. Um. Another thing is, is, is they'll send you a thing every once in a while, and they'll be like, you know, hey, there's a, and you'll also see other subscribers or other YouTubers with, once they reach milestones of subscribers, they'll get like a, a silver, you know, YouTube button, and it's like a gold YouTube button, diamond or crystal or something. I don't know when they reach like a million, and um, I I don't know. It it would be really nice to to get something like that maybe one day question mark <laughs> um i mean i put in a significant amount of time and effort and, and hard work on my videos i would say but um i mean i'm not i'm not to that oh let's just jump start you up there i mean if people really you know genuinely enjoy the content then hey you know i'm all for it but i don't think that's that's ever gonna happen it'd be nice but one can only hope and dream that one day I will be one of those YouTubers that would actually maybe be invited to VidCon. Um, that, apparently that's where all the YouTubers, you know, they have some event, they eat, drink, you know, get married, talk, people get on stage, do their shenanigans, you know, things like that. Maybe one day, you know? Um, I mean, I pretty much have a lot of hopes and dreams. When I first set out, I mean, if, if you ever really go back to the beginning of my channel, I was kind of doing vlogging at the time. There was a lot of going on in my life. And um, part of it was vlogging. Then I was like, you know what? I have all these loot boxes and loot crates at the time. I was really into that. I had a really nice job, so I was able to afford that stuff all the time. Life was completely different back then. Completely changed um, since then. And so I was able to sit there and be like, hey, look at this box this month. And I've tried to be partners with them, but you have to re reach certain requirements for that. And that's not going to work either right now. And, um, I mean, I, I pretty much, by the way, um, I'm going to put a link in the description if you've reached this far. I don't know if you folks have ever heard of Heroes of the Storm or ever been into it. Um, it's a free game, by the way. It's a, it's a really good company. It's, it's a solid. Um, pretty much by joining up. I'll put a link in the description. And you can... It's also on my Twitter, my Facebook, pretty much all my social media outlets. Um, there's a link where you can join via my link. And uh, by joining, you get several rewards. You actually get a free hero right off the start. You can also get other free heroes. And with just a little bit of time and effort, um, you can purchase a lot of heroes for free. Keyword purchase. Um... So, basically, as you play, you accumulate gold, and for, like, I mean, hell, you can get other heroes that you may like for really cheap, for, like, 2,000 gold. 2,000 gold! Let me tell you this, I can accumulate 2,000 gold in two days, and that's not even hardcore playing. They give you dailies and quests all the time. When the, when the game first started, when it first came out, there was no dailies, there was no quests. It was, hey, log in and do this, and, 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 and enjoy your play, and it was just flat out just you got gold from winning when the game first came out and then they introduced dailies and quests and things like that well long story short by you um, even just seeing if you like it or not um, you get a couple things and then yes it benefits me they give me like hey after five people you know join your thing you know you'll get like a free mount or something that you ride around on by the way it's like a motorcycle it's cool I mean it's it's worth it but it's also it's 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 really you guys get the the cool stuff. Um, I just get like a mount after so so many people, which there's so many mounts in the game. It's not funny. I have so many cool ones. You should really watch some of my hairs in the storm videos. I love doing that. Um, I was gonna do a Kelthazad video, but then with YouTube and their shenanigans, there's not a lot of uh, a lot of people have said there's not a lot like Kelthazad is not a a hero that's like ooh ha. Oh. Um, 
you know, there's no people really shining on it. It's like, oh, I went 20-0 my first game in it. And I thought it was an incredible hero. I love Kel'Thuzad. But, um... For other people, they're like, I just haven't seen a, a, a really good Kel'Thuzad player. And it's like, you know, he has no escapes. And it's like, no, he has escapes. You just have to make an escape. Um, if you know that lingo. Otherwise, you're probably lost by now. But otherwise, like I said, I'll probably put a link in the, in the description. You can always follow on my social media and stuff, too. Oh, as I start sneezing. Oh, it's that time of year. It's that time of year. I love fall. I don't like s just a little bit that comes with it. Then again, I deal with seasonal allergies for most of the year. Even through winter, I deal with seasonal allergies. That sucks. Trust me, it sucks. But, um, you yeah. know, I miss doing these. Though today is kind of lackluster. It's just, I'm kind of waiting for, for choices. Today's just waiting. Waiting. <laughs> just waiting to get it done so I can jump on other stuff, other work, and a lot of things that I need to do. And I can't get done because I'm waiting on choices. Um, which, speaking of which, I'm waiting on this. So cool, um, like I said, the, the Labor Day thing, it's a five-part special, as you saw. Um, let me check real quick and see if Choices has come out yet. Oh, well, we do this. No, it hasn't. So yeah, four more p uh, parts. They're almost back, I'm not going to spend the little Jolly Rancher of, of soda to get him back. So, I hope you all did enjoy the video. Please feel free to like, comment, share, or subscribe. Also, feel free to head down to the description down below. Um, you can always... Wow, I lost my train of thought. I apologize. Wow, that's actually the first time. You can always support my content. There's a couple links down there. And then you can also follow me on social media. Um, and until next time, with my brain actually working, um, stay well. Stay awesome, and I'll catch you all in the next video. Peace.